Hey guys, so today I'm going to talk about the grossest Magic the Gathering story ever. Um, it is extremely gross, and yes. Um, so at Phoenix Games, I feel like it was called Groovy Geckos at that time. I might be wrong. It was, I mean, the place did bankrupt like four times. Um, it's Williamsburg, Virginia. I know a lot of you want to know where this mythical store is. It's Williamsburg, Virginia. Um, at Groovy Geckos, there's this very small bathroom. The bathroom is like connected to like, it's in the back where the storage. It's a really weird place where you have like um, storage, but you also have, so the store is, Groovy Gecko looks like this. It's the front end of it is where they sell cards. A very small store, probably 400 cubic feet. No, 400 square feet, maybe less. That sounds kind of small, but it was really small. So you have very you have the Warhammer in the t in the initial store, and then you have the Magic Tables in the back. Then in the way back, you have the Dungeons and Dragons, and then you have the bathroom. And the bathroom would always flood, um, and there was carpeting. There, there, at least in the beginning, there was carpet. So yeah, that's kind of really gross, but. And it would always continue to flood. The plumber would always go. Uh, every Friday night magic I went, um, every other night it was flooding. Like it was flooded. And the reason it was flooded was because it always got clogged. And so you, there's only like, there's a few ways that you can clog a bathroom. And it's probably the most disgusting of the ways. And then it would just overflow. <laughs> and it would smell like terrible, terrible. Like it was not sanitary. Um, partially why they bankrupt four times, I imagine, is sanitation. I feel like they were never shut down for sanitation, but anyway. Um, on top of this, uh, you have people leaving like fries and sandwiches and all this type of stuff just all over the place. And that was kind of gross as well. And on top of this, you had, on top of the flooding bathroom problem, which was a consistent problem, you had the issue of no air conditioning. In Williamsburg, Virginia, it's very temperate. So it's not, it's a pretty good place to um, live in. Uh, but however, in the summertime, it does get hot. So overall, not a, uh, not the best, not the bestest, bestest, hmm. not, not the best place to play Magic the Gathering. Uh, and I want to know from you guys, is there like a store like that that you've been to that has uh, hygiene issues or has an overflowing bathroom? Uh, would you continue to go to the store? I continued to go to the store because my friend was the owner of the store and I felt really bad for him. And he couldn't really control it because, you know, like a, once a bathroom is like put in there, like it's really hard to change, you know, a bathroom. Um, and it's very expensive as well. And he lived in the same apartment complex as I did, so we would go play Magic all the time. And it was a really good, really good dude. Uh, I hope you know he's doing really well today. I haven't talked to any of those guys for a long time. Devin, Gavin, uh, Graham, um, all of those dudes. And so I don't know. Like that was probably the grossest experience I've had in Magic was the overflowing, the continuously overflowing, clogged bathroom. Um, let me know in a comment below if you guys had a very gross experience or what was your grossest experience in Magic the Gathering. Bye guys.